happening right now. Neighbors in Chicago's Woodlawn community are voicing their concerns over a migrant shelter there. CBS2 political investigator Dana Kozloff is live outside that meeting. Dana. Erica, that meeting is just getting underway at the Apostolic Church of God here in Woodlawn. 20th Ward Alderwoman Jeanette Taylor called the meeting. She says it's a way to address community concerns about what is happening in and outside of that migrant shelter at the old Wadsworth Elementary School. Now, Taylor, who also lives in this community, says she is personally seeing things occurring at, at the shelter, outside the shelter that she hasn't seen before, including loitering and partying into the late hours in areas around that former school. Other concerns, at least one fight, prostitution or possible sex trafficking and littering. But Taylor believes many of these problems are being caused by people who've been kicked out of the shelter, not by those following the rules. We need to get a handle on it now. And because the city never had a real plan, it's been an opportunity. This mayor hasn't been in office 90 days yet. And so they're working as much as they can and as hard as they can to put a plan together for everybody. Taylor says this is also an opportunity for her to update the community on what the city's plans are moving forward when it comes to handling the influx of migrants, especially over the next few weeks when city colleges classes resume. As you know, many city colleges are being used as shelters right now. And of course, it's also an opportunity for residents to voice their concerns. I'm reporting live in Woodlawn, Dana Kozlov. CBS 2 News. Erica. All right, Dana, thank you.